day the world's gonna know that I'm the best. See, I really wish you would quit telling people that you're the best. You're not the best. Hey, what's up, man? People out there, how y'all doing? Guess what? I'm not afraid to tell it. I wish a man would come to knocking at my door, Mr. Law Man. I beat my kids. I beat them bad. I, man, they listen or they don't listen. They still getting beat regardless of how I feel. You know, their minds, I should be able to beat my kids when I want to beat my kids. Yes, that explains why each and every one of them is black, like me. My daddy beat me and his daddy beat him. We're black. And in some parts of our bodies, we're purple. Never thought a black man like me could be so purple. Ask my daughters. I have three of them. And they all grown now with those bruises on their bodies. I am so crazy. I even beat their boyfriends up. I spanked them. Beat them bad. You do something wrong, like put the glass in the wrong cabin, or don't wash dishes, you get beat. Beat, beat, beat. You hear what I'm saying? That is the way you raise your kids. People always talking about my kids disrespecting me, and my kids and this and that, and my kids don't do this. Well, if you beat your kids from day one, and I mean day one, from when the when, from when the doctor smacked that butt to make sure the baby was alive, that's when you still continue beating them. You don't wait till she's two years old or three years old or four years old. You beat that baby a day after the doctor smacked them. That's when you start beating them. When she start crying, that's when you beat them. You beat them bad, you know? Not worried that baby's going to die or anything like that. You make sure there's a purple bruise on their butts. You beat them. Beat them bad, you know? And then when they get older and they want to get out of line, which they shouldn't get out of line, you beat them three times worse, you know? You go get one of those sticks in the backyard and you beat them, you know? Beat them, you know what I'm saying? I really do believe in uh, discipline. And I don't believe in putting my kids in the corner of a wall unless I'm beating them to the wall, you know? Beat your kids. Beat your kids. That is the only way. Ask each and every one of my three daughters I have. And now you can ask their boyfriends. All of them got boyfriends. And all their boyfriends been beat down by Papa, Papa Yogi. You know, real name, Dwayne. Uh, but, but they call me Daddy. Yes. Beat your kids. Beat your, it's the only way. White folks always talking about my kids are disrespecting me. And now these black parents are doing the same thing. If you listen to what I'm telling you, you will not have no problems with your kids. Your kids get out of line in a, in a store. You beat them so bad to where you hit them so hard they went right back to the car. You know, that's a hellacious beat down. You know what I mean? Shoot, if one of the babies start pissing on them, you beat them so hard in the store till they end up on the toilet in the back room of the store. You know what I mean? That's how you raise your kids. They're yours. They're not the government. The government should have no say as to how you raise your kids. They came out of your woman's stomach. You know what I mean? Your woman's stomach. You know? And you're just the supporter. And as a supporter, you have the legal rights to beat your kids. Beat your kids. Beat your kids. Beat your kids. You hear what I'm saying? Beat your kids. Beat your kids.